All right, I have a problem with procrastination. What would you do to help with this? Yeah, number one, procrastination is a normal human behavior. Um, you're never going to be able to completely rid your life of it. And so don't beat yourself up when it happens. But the key is to become ever increasingly aware of when procrastination is, is seeping in. So that moment when you first start to procrastinate, being able to quickly be aware of it and then to get back on track. I think the key there is going to be in time blocking and sticking to it. It's figuring out in order to grow my financial advisory business, these are the key things that I have to do each day. And it doesn't need to be 10 things. It needs to be like one, two, three things. These are the things, these are the activities, not the performance based things, not this many sales, not this many assets brought in under management, not this many deals closed, this many activities, this many activities that I need to do each day. And I know that if I do that, I'll succeed. Have you ever heard that, um, that story where the guy's got like this big glass jar, he's got a bunch of big rocks and a bunch of pebbles and a bunch of sand. Have you ever heard that story before? So I mean, to me that that's it. And like, for those of you that haven't heard that story, it's, you know, how do you fit all this stuff into the jar? And you start with the big rocks first, and then you sprinkle in the smaller rocks and it kind of fits in all in those little uh, gaps and nooks and crannies and then you pour the sand in last or the water or whatever it is um, and it all fits but if you were to start at the smallest to move to the biggest it wouldn't fit and so I think the key to that is making sure you're just prioritizing those things that you do um, and like just literally rank them out like where, what's most important and what are the things that you know that you just don't like to do that you need to get out of the way or you're not going to do it at all and just knock those out first that whole uh, eat the frog i guess <laughs> and uh to me that's to me that's it man because procrastination is a normal human process that we go through but you have to be able to avoid it as much as possible and putting in accountability measures in place are are what's going to stop you from hitting hitting those those periods of procrastination so whether that's a person that holds you accountable, whether it is, you know, to-do lists or your calendars or your time blocking, there's a million different things that you can do to implement accountability, whether it's using social media as an accountability tool, posting your goals uh, in your Instagram stories or posting your goals on Facebook and then, you know, keeping, keeping track of those throughout the week and then posting your results so that you can measure your results versus your goals and you can actually do this publicly in a public platform and so you know that other people are holding you accountable to that uh, since you've put it out there um, those are going to be you know some of the ways that, that I go about doing it um, but accountability is is always going to be key in order to help with your uh, problem with procrastination and a strong why is going to go a long way as well uh, being able to refer back to your why so why are you doing like whatever you're procrastinating whatever you're needing to get done, why are you doing that? Like, what's the ultimate goal? What do you want to have happen as a result of all this work that's going in?